What's up you guys, Shardimus Prime here at San Diego Comic-Con 2017 at the Sideshow booth taking a look at some hot toys and I'm gonna start off with these Justice League hot toys right over here looking dope we get the bat black we get the flash which I actually really like this version of the flash I feel like the mask is a little too thick right there already but for real I do like how that Flash looks. And what we've seen of him so far, I really like. The cyborg looks incredible. I'm really digging that cyborg. I'm liking that a lot. And we have this other Batman. This is the tactical bat suit. Oop, sorry. And then over here we have Wonder Woman, which looks pretty good. The face looks just a little off to me. I don't know what it is. It might be the hair or something, but I think she looks great for the most part. Definitely need to get this one. Go the Gilga Dope. Then we have Aquaman right over here. And this is. Is that. Yeah, it's the Justice League Wonder Woman that we were looking at a second ago. Just want to make sure. But wow. Aquaman looks really cool. That suit is very intricate. Get Superman right here. Looking pretty good. Except for the blurriness. Come on, stop being blurry, camera. There we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. And then we have the armored Batman right here with the kryptonite spear. This is the, I think this is the con exclusive one, if I remember right. The battle damaged version right there. It's not a con exclusive, is it? Yeah, I'm mistaken. Someone's gonna correct me in the comments below. I love this little one right here with the beams coming out of his eyes. That is great. And then we have more Wonder Woman hot toys. <laughs> I'm liking that face sculpt. That one looks better to me for some reason. I'm liking that. And then we have the BVS one right here, which I already have ordered. Uh, I really like this right here. We have the Amazon version, looking really good. I'm liking her. And then we have Crazy Harley Quinn, looking beautiful. And I'm just gonna zoom right past right here, get a nice look at the face. Sneak a peek right there. And then we have this, uh, wow, the Batman movie. Arkham Asylum Joker. Mm -hmm. Not looking too bad. A little mohawk going on. We have more Arkham Knight, Batman. We have the Red Hood right down there. And we have the Arkham Knight himself right here. So not looking too shabby. Whoa, not looking too shabby at all. A little bit of slow. It's not looking too bad. And then we have Batman right there. Oh, again, with the bendy cape. Looking really nice. I like that bendy cape. Gotta love that. We're gonna zoom across over here. We're gonna stick to hot toys. So I'll do. I'll probably do another video talking about statues, but I do want to look at uh, these hot toys. Ooh, look at this exoskeleton. Looking really dope. Oh, that metal chrome looks so good. Look at this is brand new Heath Ledger Joker. Looking really nice. That's cool. So these are all quarter scale figures, quarter scale hot toys. Not looking too bad. Uh, interchangeable hands. I'm liking this. Ooh, we got Predator. Look at those Predator patas. Looking really good. I like that. Wow. Woo yeah. It's not the final product. We have these uh, Valerian pieces right here. Looking too bad. And then moving on to some Star Wars. Aquí tenemos Senator Palpatine, or Emperor Palpatine, sorry. Emperor Palpatine looks awesome. Big robe right there. Then the Royal Guard. Not a whole lot going on, but still looks great. We have Anakin Skywalker. A mean face right there. Yeah, mean Anakin. Oh wow, we have some Endor Princess Leia looking gorgeous. We have some Endor Jedi Knight Luke looking awesome. We have some Force Awakens C3PO. Alright, like that. 
Well, I still need to get the regular version. We have R2-D2 over here to be determined. This is the Force Awakens version. We have uh, Force Awakens Luke. Or is it the Last Jedi Luke? Nope, it's Force Awakens Luke. And we have the Assault Tank Commander. Wow. Kind of big on the helmet, but still looks really good. Okay. We have... Um, oh, shoot, I, I, I want to say... Uh, uh, damn it, uh, uh, damn it, uh, uh, the, 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 the Jin or so, that's right. Uh, the names, that looks really good. This is Jones. K2SO. Really nice here, too. Bam, K2SO. I'm loving that weathering around the edges. That looks really nice. Very pleased. We get another Jin right over here. Yeah. Wow. She does look beautiful. She does look beautiful. I like it. Wow, look at that cape on Luke over there. That looks awesome. And then we have more Star Wars. And wow. Grand Moff Tarkin. Darth Vader. So many Hot Toys Darth Vader figures. It's, it's unbelievable. We have the Death Star Trooper right here. Death Star Operator. Dude. Uh, what's and you get Boba Fett with alternate colors, which I cannot say I'm truly excited about. I mean, really, I mean, come on, I don't know. But it may not be Boba Fett. No, it's Boba Fett animation version. Okay. So I'm not familiar with the animation and what that's from. But this Leia looks stunning. Hey, Leia, it looks like she's actually looking at me. Wow, that is great. Possible thumbnail shot right there, possible. And then this Han looks really good too. Really liking that. I like the smirk too. I think they did capture. Yeah, very cool. I like that. We have the Death Star Gunner right there. And then we have the Stormtrooper. This is like the dirty Stormtrooper. It's got dust and dirt and everything. Then Jedi Knight Luke. I missed out on the pre order for this at BBTS. I'm really bummed out. I had to change my card info on there, and by the time I got everything fixed, I missed out on the damn pre-order, man! But I think I'll figure out a way to get a hold of one, because I really want this one very, very much. Looks very cool. And then let's move on to some Marvel. And there's some vehicles here we're going to take a look at in a second, too, so hang tight. Let's, uh, let's, go, let's go ladies first, because, you know, ladies are hella sick, and we got hella right over here, so, yeah. She looks fantastic. Wow, oh, th this design is just so awesome. I feel like this headpiece could be bigger. I don't know, just from what I've seen so far, I feel like that headpiece could be bigger, but still, she looks great. And then I'm gonna come around this way. We have Doctor Strange. I've seen reviews on this already. I do wanna get a hold of this one. No ankle pivot on that, but still looks really cool. We got cape pivot, get that bendy wire, so. That's looking dope. Oh my god, that Hulk looks so awesome. Hulk butt, all right. And what is it, the Cosmic Cube? Uh, I don't know exactly, but wow, Loki in blue, huh? I didn't realize he was wearing blue for this movie. Okay. But it still looks like Tom Hiddleston. That's an important thing. But yeah, I didn't know that he was gonna be in blue. All right, good guy. Uh, good guy Loki, I guess, teaming up with Thor. Again, right? Didn't he team up Thor in, in the sequel, Thor? This is looking really good too. Can't see any joints, those arms, so they're looking using that rubbery uh, material. And then we have the Gladiator Thor, looking great. I'm gonna lose it here in a second because that Hulk is looking amazing. Wow, that shield looks great too. Valkyrie, she looks awesome. I like that we're having a black Valkyrie, I think that's cool. I almost wanted a black Wonder Woman, to be honest with you. I'm not lying, but I'm stoked Valkyrie. Stoked about Valkyrie, but not as stoked as I am about the freaking Hulk, man! Look at that thing! Uh, I'm not even looking through the viewfinder right now, I'm sorry. I'm just looking at this figure. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Uh, these head sculpts, these patas. Oh man, that, that, whatever the hell that is, uh, that mohawk, uh, oh man, sorry, I am excited, I am truly thrilled about this, yeah, I cannot wait to get 
I mean, I hope I can get this. I, I'm not gonna guarantee. Ah, oh, man, sorry, blurry, blurry. Hold on, hold on. It's just the reflections around here can be tricky sometimes, but yeah, loving that head sculpt. Oh my goodness. I am just thrilled about this one, man. This looks so badass. Woo! That Hulk. Man. Ah, okay. I could just hang around here and look at that Hulk forever, but there's a lot more stuff to look at. I'm gonna look at the ceiling, so I don't have to get people signing media release forms or anything like that, but here we go. Damn, we got a little baby group. I guess he comes with the Drax, so we're getting a new Drax already. Still looking more gray than green, and you know, I, I have to argue that debate that I really think that he looked more green than gray. Oh, is that? Especially seeing the movie a second time, I was like, nah, he's definitely more green than gray. I don't care what they say in interviews or whatever, man. I, I see more green than gray. I don't know, but we could agree to disagree on that. Zoe Saldana looking pura linda, pura linda esta Zoe Saldana. So her hair needs to be touched up maybe, but still, she looks great. And then we get Rocket. I love that they have jetpacks, by the way. I've talked about jetpacks numerous times, and Rocket looks fantastic. Look at that. Woo. Rocket 2 is, wow, look at that thing. I love seeing Rocket with a big old gun. That head sculpt. Yes! I like it. Yondu. Yondu Udantu. Looks great. Looks just like Michael Rooker. Love that smirk. Straight up Yondu. Love that. That is awesome. Product shown is not final. Pending licensor and talent approval. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you like this, Michael Rooker. You know, hopefully you approve. And then we have the jetpack thing right here for a Star Lord. And that effect right there. I think that's an exclusive effect. I, I can't remember off the top of my head, but it looks pretty good. And then we have a quarter scale, I think, or no, life size baby Groot right there with interchangeable heads, interchangeable. Uh, fingers and stuff like that. I love that. That is cute as hell. I am cute is what John Bailey, the epic voice guy, calls the movie. And then we have Punisher with all of his weapons right over here looking awesome. Hot Toys, Netflix figures. Great, I don't want to get in the shot. But it's got the old Gatling gun and that head sculpt looks fantastic. <laughs> that is awesome. And Punisher. I do have my Marvel Legends on the front porch <laughs> waiting for me at home. The Marvel Legends Netflix figures are at home on the porch all by themselves. Hopefully nobody jacks my Marvel Legends. But man, this is fantastic. Ghost Rider. Wow. You know, I haven't seen the Shield, Agents of Shield episodes yet that have this Ghost Rider, but I gotta say, so far I like it. So far I do like it. He looks pretty sweet. I mean, look at that man. That looks freaking cool. Somebody's face in the background. Wow. Love that. That looks great. Very stoked about this. Hope to get it. And then, looking at the floor over here, and coming up ever so slowly to some more Hot Toys. So here's the exclusive uh, shades, uh, thanks to Siri Emerald. I'll be able to take a look at this right here, along with the bones, which you can see right over here. So just doing quick glimpses at these, looking fantastic. And we have the Mark 47 Iron Man, looking boop. Liking that a lot. Hope to get a hold of this. Is this the power pose? Yes, it is the power pose. Yep. And then we have the homemade suit the Spidey right there. Looking awesome. I'm loving that. I love that homemade suit. Even though I like the tech suit most. I like the tech suit more than that suit that they showed at the end of the movie. I mean, really. But yeah, that looks great. Very stoked about that. It looks pretty poseable too because that material is not too tight on his uh, on the body. And then here's the accessories for the actual hot toys, not the power pose. Uh, Mark 47. Looking sick. And then we have the tech suit Spidey. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry. Tech suit Spidey right there. He comes with the vulture head if you get the exclusive, I think. Or the deluxe version anyway. And he's got his book, and that looks awesome. I'm loving that. 
That looks great. I should have worn it. Very, very stoked for that. Yeah. Very nice looking. It's like a, a material, seeing it in person, it's it's different than the other Spider-Man figures for sure. It's definitely more of a fabric uh, than than uh, polyester type of material, so I'm, I'm stoked about that. Except for the pants. The leggings look like they're kind of like that vinyl, or not vinyl, but polyester type material. And then I'm going to show off, uh, you know, just really quick, we have a... Uh, we have some Disney stuff right here. We have Jack and Jack. There's Jack and Jack. Jack and Jack. Jack and Jack. Right on. Very hey, good cosplay, man. There is a, there is a uh, captain in there. Oh, Captain. <laughs> sorry. Captain Jack. Captain Jack. Captain Jack. Captain Jack. Did not mean any disrespect. Apologies. <laughs> Right. Some bell looks really good right here. Oh wow, they, they really nailed the likeness. Um, she has those rubbery arms. So I have not seen the Beauty and the Beast movie, but yeah. And then I haven't seen the new Pirates movie. But that shark looks like dead shark looks cool. Very good looking Jack Sparrow. And then I'm not gonna get a look at these statues over here. I'm gonna save that for another video. Uh, but I will get a look at some of the vehicles, so we're just gonna look at the ceiling because, you know, I'm not sure everybody wants to get filmed. Sorry, you guys. And oh, look at this thing. Wow. This is monstrous. I'm sorry. Go for it. Right on, thank you very much. Thank you. That is great. So you get this full. Oh, and, and you can fit the, the real one in there. It looks like a fake one. Oh my god. 825. Yeah, that's the actual six. Scale. It's not like you yeah, could buy a car with that or anything. Yes. I mean, I'm that's just saying, but oh wow. God. Look at this. So, if you're planning to get that new whip, say goodbye to your new ride. You've got to get this whole cluster instead, man. Luckily, I already got my van a couple of, yeah, a couple years ago, so a year ago or so. So, yeah, but wow, this thing is huge. Uh, I I wish I could figure out a way to scale it. I mean, like. There's a couple average sized dudes standing to my left, and this thing is at about like their waistline and up to their head. If you don't mind being on camera, yeah. See? This guy's taller than me too, so and I'm 5'10. I mean it's it's half the size of a human. It's just half the size of a human. That is crazy. Oh my goodness. And then Ripley over here, she looks great too. She's in the power loader. Looking fantastic. Like that. And then we have the flying DeLorean. Hey, that's my jacket! Minus the pins, but yeah. Hit Marty in leather. Wow, that does look like my FMC. I mean, actually, that is my jacket. I have that. Is it missing? No, that's actually the same. I have the same exact jacket. Yeah. And then uh, it's just missing the pins. And then we have Doc. Oh my God, my dad has that same exact jacket. No, I don't know. I think I have that jacket too. Don't know about this head sculpt. Uh, actually, not too bad. I don't know about the, the facial expression choice. Fun Glorian, man. And then... Wow. How can I get another wow? That looks incredible. Jeez. I say jeez. 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 Alright, let's go wait for a Tortuga over here for this photo. Wow. That is dope. I love this Batmobile, man. Love this Batman. Very stoked off of this. I mean, I'm definitely not getting this, but it looks incredible. You got some lights right there. That is sweet. And they have contests here to enter to win and all that, well, yada, yada, yada. So, yep, very stoked about this, you guys. All right, stay tuned for more San Diego Comic-Con coverage. Uh, for those of you that join up with Team Shardimus, you should have seen an exclusive video earlier today. And, uh, yeah, I will be posting, I will be covering the Hasbro booth soon and more to come. All right, stay tuned. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.